What's good, my G's? Woo! If you wonder why I just did that, that cringe ass woo is because number one, I do not fucking feel like recording right now. Number two, I'm low key demotivated. And number three, something that I wanted did not really end up working out. But you know where all these unite together? I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. It's ironic. It's a beautiful irony. This video that I'm gonna be recording today. Because it's not about how you feel in life. It's not. It's not about the situation you're in, but how you deal with the situation. Right now, I'm coming to you from a super authentic place right now. This smile is an authentic smile because it's a smile in discouragement. I'm tired as fuck right now, my G's. I'm tired as fuck. And after I finish recording this video, if I have the strength to make another one, I will. So I have time to be with editing and stuff. I'm gonna go straight to the gym. When I'm done with the gym, I just finished cleaning up the fucking kitchen. I'm gonna come home. I'm gonna cook myself a healthy ass, delicious ass dinner, clean that shit up, and then edit for the rest of the fucking day till I go to sleep. That's the hustle. Do I feel like it today? Absolutely not. And this happens many days, but you still have to fucking put in the grind. Give me a second. Drink your water. So, I'm ready to get motivated just because I'm, each step you do something when you don't feel like it, you start feeling better. Just because I turn on the camera, I'm feeling so much better. But, and cleaning up and everything, when I go to gym, I tell you, by the time I finish all the steps, I'm gonna go to bed with a smile on my face. But that's all this is about. What is this about? This is about, <sighs> one word, guys. Per so fucking virence Consistency, perseverance, and determination. And that is who the character of today will be about. Rock fucking Lee. My G from Naruto. The one who never, ever fucking gave up. The one who was dealt the shittiest hand. Black pill as far as it can be. In Naruto, you have the guys, for those of you who don't know Naruto or anime, with ninjutsu, genjutsu, different abilities, different talents. What does Rock Lee have? His fists. His body, taijutsu, fucking chuhua. Does he complain? No. Are there other times he feels broken? Yes, time and time again. But does he give up? Hell not. Nah. So we're gonna watch a clip together and I'm gonna get into it. I'm gonna get into it why it's beautiful and lessons you can learn. Someone can say, but this is just fantasy, Brian. Guess what? Most of the best lessons in life come from fucking fantasy. Lessons people can learn from books and things like that. That's why it exists. Because we absorb these things and they teach us and they give us strength to, to confront things in life that can seem overwhelming, okay? Let me open this up. <laughs> Let me pop on my headphones. One second, my G's. So that's the no talent overachiever I've heard so much about. Rock Lee. The dork with nothing going for him but a little lousy Tai Jutsu. <laughs> Dummy, why bother? You'll never be a ninja. <laughs> Will too. There's no way a kid who can't even do ninjutsu can ever be a ninja. Yes, I can. Whatever. I don't get why you're even at this ninja academy. But you kept that in, didn't you? You kept practicing your little lousy taijutsu. How about me, Sensei? I want to show I can be a splendid ninja as well. Even if I do not have ninjutsu or genjutsu. I want to prove it to the whole world! There's that look in his eye. True or not, you didn't listen to them. You... You never gave up. Lee doesn't know how to give up. I do not want to see tears from anyone close to me ever again. This is what people see. Sorry for interrupting. This is what people see. When you make it or when you get to a certain level, people see this and they're like, wow, look at this. This guy has everything handed to him. From doing <laughs> hustling, looks back to many things in life. I have many friends of mine or stuff or guys. <laughs> they're like, man, you have it so easy or shit like that. Not many of them because the things you achieve in life will earn you respect. But I've got sometimes some more normie minded individuals <laughs> maybe not friends but like acquaintances and guess what 
There's a whole story behind someone who achieves in every situation. Because someone can be lucky, win the, the lottery, but they ain't gonna stay up there. They're gonna go bye bye. People who are up there, even if it's in different areas in life, they've earned it through perseverance and fucking determination in one way or another. Let's continue. That is why I am You're never suffering. going to lose again, Guy Sensei. Never! You have the gift of perseverance, and that's what makes you a genius, too. There are two different kinds of ninja. Those like you who are born with talent and do not have to work at it. And those like me. The ones who have to train every day of our lives. I do not know if I can take it. Sometimes it seems like the whole thing is pointless. Like I am a loser and I will always be a loser. I do not know what to do. You're right, all the effort here is pointless. If you don't believe in yourself. The rejuvenated Leaf Village's handsome devil! Rock Lee! That boy has something important to prove. And he's determined to prove it, even at the cost of his life. Up there! No one could do that through sheer effort alone. Or is truly a genius. Awesome. Absolutely fucking legendary. There's an even better video on YouTube, but it's like 20 minutes or 19 minutes. I can, I might link it in the description if I remember to. <laughs> I should, which is even more beautiful and it really shows the background and the struggle and the hustle because this is just like all the compact one. So Rock Lee, he doesn't have all this shit, but he doesn't give up. He has such an immense willpower. He's just always training. You see him there doing a thousand push-ups, a thousand this. If he fails, he does it again. He doesn't get discouraged. He gets encouraged from his failures and from the burdens and stuff. And that's what you guys have to have too. Life can be fucking brutal. There are gonna be things you're hoping for and wishing for with the burning of your heart. Things that you were anticipating that get fucked up because life will build up something for you and it'll smack it down. But that's what life, life's about. Life was not meant to be easy. Life was meant to be a struggle. But struggle gives you strength. So that's why I love this character. And I love these characters. Please put in the comments down below characters that you think are black color related. The next one I'll do when I end up doing it will be Guts for sure from Berserk because it doesn't get more black pill than that. Well, <laughs> black pill. This is what I would say is red pill. Even in Guts actually because the blood pill, not red pill, blood pill. Because the blood pill is you accept the truths and realities of the black pill because you have to. <laughs> I would even say <laughs> Rock Lee's more whitish pill in fantasy. Although he does accept the facts. And guess what? He ends up becoming OP as fuck. He beats in the little act that he's in when it's uh, the games, the shonen games. I forgot what they're called. The tournament. He basically claps, almost. Well, the most powerful fucking characters in that act of naruto fucking soon to be hokage or he was a hokage of the rockville sand village i forgot i'm, I'm not up to date guys <laughs> but crazy glorious epic inspiring that's all i gotta say do it when you don't feel like it put in the effort even if you just do one little step at a time the the rewards will be so unimaginable in some things in life when you actually don't feel like doing it compared to when you do that you can't even believe it because it builds character it really builds character and that can get you so far in life things can seem impossible i remember so many things i would have never have thought i'd be here compared to the brian at 14 who would who thought he would he would never have a girlfriend and he came to peace in terms of that that he'd never be cool or all these sort of things then things change you achieve it and you realize those aren't even the goals and desires in life you want to, 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 to search for passion and there's more to just women and just looks and coolness and stuff. There's more that actually can give a man a drive and that's passion, the burning desire to actually create something crazy. 
But yeah, that's my two cents on this, guys. If there's anything we can learn from this, from Rock Lee, is of course not giving up. See, he didn't give up even when he fell down. Mentor, actually a really important thing is a mentor. Having somebody you can look up to, somebody you can light that fire back up with when it's needed. And he had Guy Sensei, who Madara even said was the fucking strongest one of them all with his, 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 the gate of the soul and the gate of death and stuff. Crazy ridiculous. But yeah, guys, keep going. Keep going. Don't let your will break. And even if it fucking breaks, just keep on crawling. Just keep on crawling. Eventually, you'll get, regain that energy and you'll be running again. I right? Peace. Appreciate you guys. And I wonder if you noticed the audio. We got a better mic, which is sick. Bye-bye. Brian Hansen. Yeah, I'm gonna take that fucking